Hello everybody, my name is George Breyer and uh, I just wanted to uh, introduce you to one of my favorite tools for developing my mindset and that is my little iPod here. All right, I just purchased uh, probably a week ago today um, an audio book called uh, Secret of the Millionaire Mind by T. Harv Ecker and I've listened to it twice um, in the last week and um, you know it's good stuff man, good stuff. If you have not read that book or listened to that book, I recommend you get it. I recommend that you get it. And one of the things that I picked up on it um, right away um, was early on in the book because they talked about your um, um, your money blueprint, all right? And everything that you've learned about money, good or bad, based on um, how you were raised and what you were taught, uh, or uh, how you were influenced about money. Now, have you ever heard anyone say money isn't that important? I've heard it. I've heard it a lot through uh, throughout life. And isn't that crazy? Money isn't that important. You know who says money is not that important? Are people that are broke. Okay? And and if you're broke right now, that's okay, but you don't have to stay broke. All right? Now, money is not that important. Now, don't you need money to um pay your bills, um provide shelter, uh, eat? You know, take care of your family. I mean, money's pretty darn important, right? So, by saying that money is not important, you're programming yourself to think that money is not that important. Well, money is important. In fact, I rank it right up there with oxygen, right? Now, um, so what I want you to get away from this, uh, take away from this little video is get the book Secret of a Millionaire Mind by T. Harv Ecker, okay? I have a millionaire mind. All right, and if you read the book or listen to the book, you'll know more about why I said that and did that. But also, I wanted to point out real quick is I got my new copy of Success Magazine, Success Magazine, and I get uh, uh, I get this every single month. Look, in fact, here's proof. Look at all of the Success Magazines I get. I get them all and I keep them all. And I refer to all of them. And one of my favorite things about uh, getting this every month is you get a CD. You get a CD in there. Uh, my CD's not in there because it's in my CD player. And the first part uh, of the CD this month, they're talking about a part in Caddyshack where uh, Chevy Chase is um, telling, uh, I can't think of the character's name, about how you have to be the ball. Remember that part? Be the ball. And they use that... Um, um, when they're uh, talking about, let's see here, I think it was Mel Robbins, or no, John C. Maxwell. No, actually it was uh, Mel Robbins talking about being the ball. And when life knocks you down, you need to be the ball because um, when, when the ball hits the ground, it bounces up. So the harder that you fall, the higher you need to bounce up. All right, so be the ball. Okay, so thanks for taking the time to watch this video. Remember, work on your mindset every day and you can achieve anything you want in your life. You just need to think the right thoughts. All right, if you're thinking bad thoughts, don't believe yourself. All right, talk to you soon. Make it a great day.